Hey, um, it's me again. Today is September the 4th, and it's 1 o'clock p.m. And I've been observing this hurricane pretty much ever since it started. Now, what I did notice, um, this hurricane has been staying away from the coast of, of Florida. And it's been, it looks like it's been pushed away by the so-called, um, Doppler radars that we have throughout United States and I want to show you an example of the Doppler radar that we have currently in Jacksonville, Florida. It's based off the Jacksonville Airport and as you can see right here, I'm seeing some Doppler, um, I'm seeing this black line in between the green color and the red color and it's actually targeting the hurricane as you can see right here. The black line is coming from the K Jax Doppler radar. Um, for me, these are so called harp radio frequency radars, and they're just being mimicked as Doppler radars. But these um, radars are probably taking an effect right now, and this is why we're seeing the hurricane being pushed away from the coast from the coastline mm -hmm. I'm thinking that these are harp radio frequency radios and they're being used right now because it's strange how this hurricane has just been fighting its way to the coast of the, the, the United States of Florida and the hurricane seems to be like trying to force its way in but something is preventing the hurricane from hitting us so as you can see right here this Doppler radar it's shooting like a black beam right in between those two colors the green and the red and the hurricane is it's like right in the middle of the hurricane you can see right here right I'm gonna go to another Doppler radar up north and it has a similar pattern to this um, Doppler radar over here in Jacksonville I'm gonna I'm gonna click this um, Doppler radar right here which is I think is a uh, state borough up Georgia Let's click on it, and I'm seeing the same pattern. If you look at the the middle coming from the in the green between the green and the red, you can see the same black mark, the black line is going straight directly to the hurricane. All right, so something is controlling this hurricane. Something is moving this hurricane from not hitting the coastal of the east. And for me, I think harp is being used. And I'm going to show you an, another raider, um, one here in Kissimmee. And you're going to see a similar pattern. There you go. You have the, the green color and the red color. And in between, you have the black pattern again. And the black pattern is shooting directly to the hurricane. It's like they're actually, these Doppler raiders harp radar stations are actually active and they are pushing this hurricane away from the east coast it's strange as you can see right here you can see that black line ran right between the two colors the green and the red and it's centered right on the hurricane and i could only select multiple um i can't select all radar dopplers it just, there, there's a whole bunch of them here look at this there's a whole bunch of them here but for some reason it won't let me select the ones down here somewhere. Palm Coast, they got one there too. I'm gonna click on this guy right here, Valdosta. As you can see, Valdosta also is showing a similar pattern. It's radiating, and then you can see the, the, the green and the red, and you can see the black in between, and it's pointing directly again to the hurricane. As you can see right here, the, the black pattern. I'm, I'm trying to think and maybe that's some high um, radio frequency concentration that they're beaming the hurricane to try to steer the hurricane away from hitting the east coast of Florida. So that's another pattern of that. Um, that's what I noticed earlier. The green and the red and in between you have that black pattern and it's directly aiming the hurricane. And it's coming from, this one's coming from Atlanta. I'm sorry, from Baldosta. All right. So it's, it's strange to see this pattern and there's another um, Doppler radar up here next to um, Mertley Beach. I could select this guy right here up north 
and you're seeing the similar but the hurricane is still far 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 away but you can still see that um black pattern in the middle between the red and the green so i'm trying to figure out if they're trying to stir this um away the hurricane and it's it's strange and here's another one right here uh which is this one right here this is a kclx another doppler radar and you can see that black pattern is actually right is heading is shooting towards the hurricane so you have that green pattern and you have the red pattern and in the middle you have that black pattern and it's shooting directly to the hurricane so there's obvious something going on here i mean something's being controlled and manipulated here in this storm as you can see there was also uh, another there's another doppler radar right here but it won't let me select it it's like they've been disabled i said the one in miami See, in this one, they already lowered the frequency waves for this Doppler radar, so I'm not seeing that black pattern that we were seeing on the other on the other ones up there. I don't see the black pattern here. All I see is red and green. I'm not seeing the black pattern, so they're not they're not actually maybe not transmitting full watts because there's no storms here. Um, but as you can see, it's obvious as that this one right here it has that black beam. It's got a black beam shooting directly to the hurricane it's probably just pushing it up north a little bit and then you have the one in jacksonville airport once again and then you have the black beam shooting directly again to the hurricane and that one is pushing the hurricane towards the east and it's probably not making the this is why we're not able to see the the storm here in jacksonville i haven't seen hardly any rain and it looks like these are my Doppler radars or heart radio stations are transmitting at full power right now trying to disperse this hurricane away from the east coast and you can see right here the other Doppler KCLX the same thing you got that black beam right in the, in the middle between the red and the green and it's aiming directly at the hurricane so for me these Doppler radars or so called Doppler radars for me they are just harp station and they're controlling the weather they could control the weather the weather so in bahamas they don't have none of these stations whatsoever they don't have none of these station whatsoever so i feel sorry for these guys if they did had have any harp station radio frequency they could have probably prevented the storm from hitting them directly um but yep as you can see right here you see that black beam Something is going on here is very very fishy with these Doppler radars. I think they are Actually disguised harp radio stations and they are denying it to the public, but guess what? I'm not stupid. You could call me conspiracy theory. You could call me nut You could tell me where my thin hat aluminum hat guess what? United States possesses technology to control hurricanes and they do possess technology to gear and steer hurricanes away from us whenever they feel like and they know this would be a massive storm so guess what they didn't want to do no more damage to the united states so they just decided to steer the hurricane away but um it's obvious here as you can see again i'm in jacksonville i'm in jacksonville you see it and i do notice uh i've been getting a lot of headaches lately and i hear a lot of um like tones rings in my ear so i don't know if it's related to these harp radios they're transmitting at full power and maybe causing some of these some of these issues but once again you can see that black line in between the two colors green and red and it's actually aiming directly at the hurricane's path right now as i speak and then you have the one up north at georgia also doing a similar um pattern as well So it's obvious that you got black beams shooting directly to the hurricane and they're pushing the hurricane away. And I can't, before I was able to click on any of these little white dots, which is Dopplers, and now I'm not able to click on hardly any of these um, Doppler radars. So it looks like the ones that are close to the coast, they're using those the most. And just to let you know, that's what I'm thinking. Um, thanks for watching my video and stay stay safe and thanks for watching my video once again